All right, guys, welcome back to another episode. I got John here with me. I got Jay over here. Episode 104. Welcome back. We appreciate everybody that's rocking, liking, sharing, subscribing. Don't forget to do just that. Hit that notification bell so you're notified every time we drop, man. Yeah. But listen, like your blunt, like your J pack, your bomb pack, your bow. You know how the fuck we rock, man. We bite, we bite, we bite. How we feeling today, boys? How we feeling? Amazing. I feel um, fucking great. You look great. You, I mean, hey, bro. I mean, wow. I'm trying to Straight just brush to it. it off. You know what I mean? And keep it going. That's life. He's, he's trying to brush it off and keep it going. That's life. Everyone should take notes. Don't brush your shoulders off. Oh. Ladies as pimps too. Oh. Go on, brush your shoulders off. Yeah. Oh. What is that, T.I.? That's T.I. Whoa. Get the wow. F- wow. We're done. We're done. This it's already game over. Turn off your shoulder. Nah, it's Jay-Z. Oh, we, <laughs> we know. We know. That's Jay-Z. Yeah. All right, man. <laughs> he almost had me. Almost, almost. But now, nah, guys, listen, man. So Conor McGregor, guys, we're going to get straight the <laughs> fuck oh, into man, it. I missed it. I didn't watch the fight, but I saw him on a stretcher, and that's all I needed to see. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> now nah, I saw the video. I forgot to send it to you guys. My mom sent it. She, she was watching, and she's like, holy fuck. And then she sent me the video, and this guy literally, it was a freak accident. It wasn't like, oh, he whooped his ass and he broke his leg. No, it was literally he took a step back awkwardly oh. and, and the whole like bottom top oh, ankle nah. snapped, like snapped in half. And he was just like, he Did, just, was it from a, like a kick? Did he, no, no, he just no, 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 no. It was more it was like, just like an awkward. He was just, yeah, it was, it was just a freak accident. And then people, and then he was walking around like he's the tough guy. Like he fucking won. Like, no, bitch. He took a Yo, weird what step. the fuck? Though? Yeah. Wow. It wasn't like, oh, he punched him and he but fucking. you know what I think? I'm like, bro, you train every day for this. How'd you break your shit just walking? Yeah, backwards. that's what it was. He took a step <laughs> back and it just snapped. Hey, sometimes those guys have underlying yeah. injuries that they don't really, that's you know true. what I'm saying? Because they're like, oh, I'm a fighter. I'm supposed to be a tough guy. I ain't telling nobody. But it's like, nigga, you got to take care of your shit because that shit happens. You know now the real money fight is number four. Wait for it. So to be real, <laughs> so to be real, <laughs> McGregor, McGregor would have won. This is planned. I was feel he like. was he winning though? Like on the scoreboard, or not, was I'm he not, whooping his I'm ass? I'm not 100 percent sure. We gotta watch the fight. Yeah, I'm not, I gotta watch I'm not 100 percent sure, but what I've been hearing is that McGregor should have won. How about Sean O'Malley? Did he win last night? I don't know. I don't. I don't even know who that is. The dude with the purple hair, the with curly hair, he's a skinny dude. He's I know. I know who he dude. is, but I don't he know. He was fighting bro. last night too. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I haven't kept up with that type of shit in a minute. Yeah, I just catch it after. I fucked with you. I catch it after. I could have bought it on Xbox. They were like, "Oh, HBO, you could buy it right now." And I was thinking about it. Yeah, it was probably was like a hundred bucks. Nah, I wasn't gonna spend. Yeah, it. I'm yeah not gonna that's spend a lot for that turnout. And that's what I mean. Imagine the people that paid a hundred bucks, bro, yeah. and now McGregor broke his foot in a mm-hmm. fucking thirty seconds. You just paid a hundred bucks to watch that. You know yeah. what I mean? It's I, think like, it, I think it was longer than that, though. I, I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I know it was like. It was worth looking at. Like, it's different. Yeah. I'll buy it if it's like, yo, it's like six of us throwing in like 10, 15. But you know yeah. what I'm saying? And we just that having a few sense. beers. But if it's just me by myself at my house, it's like, bro, I'll catch that tomorrow. Yeah, like, they do. I'll Man. catch it on Instagram. You got people all the way in the top or in the back. They're like, what the fuck just happened? All I saw him was fall. They didn't even see his fucking foot break. That's so, but, but the people up close when they're, you know what I mean? They're like, oh, shit. That's, That's why you fucking pay gross. fucking like 10 racks I to sit right there. Like, get up, pussy. I paid $10,000. Get the fuck up and finish this imagine shit. you throw bet. some motherfucking dirt yeah. on it all Ima- right imagine you fuck dirt imagine if you fucking <laughs> bet on it bro like you're betting and your homie just broke his leg you're like oh. that's fucked uh, nah but i'm gonna tell you what i would have bet on mcgregor hey guys yeah, listen that's my man the next man fighting con mcgregor you got it in you got it in for you bro like that's gonna be a tough one because he's coming back trust me yeah he's gonna come back from yeah. this one he's not coming back like Playing around, yeah, no, no. John's yeah. gonna fight fucking Jake Paul. Yeah, so <laughs> be on like, the lookout for that. You sound like fucking. Uh, yeah, I think you. I think you actually got him, bro. You sound like Mike. Mike no cap. <laughs> No, nah, no, nah, uh, Mike from from uh, Crunch. He has a video and he boxes and he's tagging. He's trying to get fucking Paul's attention. He's like, I could beat you. And every single nah, minute, Michael <laughs> fuck that and nigga. <laughs> and hey, shout out to you, Mike. That nigga people, fuck Paul up. There's some haters on that bitch. There's people commenting, "Oh, you get your ass whooped. Oh, you're trash." Hey, that's fine. Enough oh, people. You know enough people comment. My boy and he Mike. Gets, <clears throat> if enough people comment, who knows, bro? Yeah. Hey, it's a crazy world. If, yeah. What, what, what yeah. if he does fight fucking Paul, bro? I don't know. Hey, man. I mean, shit. I hope you whoop his ass, bro, and fucking nah, do bro, something. Yeah, you Yo, better fuck Tyson, him up. Um, Tyrone Woodley is his name from UFC. He's fighting Jake Paul, isn't he? Next. Is he? He's the dude next. He's being trained by Floyd. Mm. Jesus. Yeah, that's gonna be the next fight. We'll see. But that's the thing about it, bro. A lot of these guys are guys that aren't good at boxing. 
And they're stepping into a boxing ring. Like, this nigga's good at, he's a black belt in jiu-jitsu. Like, he does wrestling. He, he does all this other shit. If yeah. he steps in there and wins, then That's I what I say. That's the same thing I said about Floyd. I was like, yeah, the fight with McGregor was cute. Yeah, But if he cute. could kick you across your fucking neck, bro. <laughs> nah. Like, yeah, come on, bro. bro. Them kicks are fucking brutal. No, they're vicious. Fuck. You know how much they're stronger vicious. your leg is than your it, arm, bro? If I get into a fight. With somebody and they start throwing kicks at me, it's I'm, over. Yeah, I'm, I'm, no, you got it. Uh, no, 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 down and shit, you got position. it, <laughs> <laughs> bitch. I'm gonna be doing fucking cartwheels and fucking doing something to get. <laughs> yeah, bro, you gotta fuck. I'm, you gotta I'm, buy I'm gonna, the be, weed, I'm gonna be that guy from Tekken. You know the one that's like. Uh, as crazy as it is, bro, that's, <laughs> how, that's how you got to fight, though, moving, around, moving yeah. around. It's hard Honestly, to hit a moving target. the thing is, your head is, exactly, your head is a fucking target. Yeah. That's why you see them move, they constantly move their head and yeah. they move it to the side. Because, nigga, if you keep it right here, it's just easy, easy. to fucking punch you in your face. Like, but uh, ultimately, bro, fuck all that, man. Yeah. Like, I ain't fighting nobody if at this age. they got a big-ass age. cauliflower here, oh, no, no. leave that dude alone. Yeah, that cauliflower here is serious, bro. I've seen, serious, it too. I've seen that. that life. Yeah, that cauliflower here ain't no fucking joke. <laughs> He's going to put you to sleep. No, that means that or he... Or choke you to fucking yeah. death. He does <laughs> not care how he comes out of that fight. Yeah, bro. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 facts, facts. <laughs> He like does you, not care. you're like, bro, I got brand new shoes. I yeah. just got my fucking haircut. He don't care about none of that nah, shit, bro. No. He'll lose it all tonight. Bro, you seen Khabib <laughs> in that one press conference with the this, this Johnny Cage looking ass dude with sunglasses? He's like all oh, talking about Khabib. And Khabib's like, hey, sunglasses. He's like, who are you? Who are you? He's like, because he's like, who? He's like, when you street fight? He's like, street fight's illegal in America. He's like, I'm really from the mountains. I'm landing it from Russia, <laughs> oh, bro. Oh, shit. He's not Yo, from the Khabib mountains. Khabib is no joke, bro. He's Fair. been wrestling bears since he was a kid. That dude's an animal. Holy and he man. went undefeated. He's like, retired undefeated. Nobody beat Khabib. Mm. Yeah, no, Khabib. Anybody, like, anybody named Khabib, I don't think I would want to. Hey, listen, bro. He's from Real Mountain. He's from Real Mountain. Real Mountain. Yo, but not for real, bro. He's listen, bro. You don't want to. There's certain guys that are just fucking savages. Yeah, like they're different, man. They're literally fighting machines. Like that's what they do. That's what they love to do. That's what they get up to live for. The Diaz to brothers fuck you <laughs> up. That's why you never see them like fight on the streets and shit like that. Like UFC <laughs> fighters ain't going around whooping people's asses. Nah, they're harnessing that shit. For that octagon, nigga, because they're like they're just different. Well, you can't they're fight. Different. Well, you're 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 an official fighter, so <clears throat> if you, yeah, no, you yeah, go to jail. Yeah, you're going to jail. Like yeah. they're gonna look at you and be like, "Bro, you know how to fight, fight." No, your hands like, are lethal. considered lethal weapons. They're registered. Yeah. They're registered, registered lethal weapons. It's like you got a Glock on this one and a Glock on this one. Bitch. <laughs> and you got extended, <laughs> extended fucking a big dick. <laughs> you got an extended mag right here, bitch. And this bitch is gonna hit you a hundred yards away, bitch. I promise nah, you. Facts. Yeah, facts. You got me. Listen, fucked up. man. You ever been talking about somebody before, guys, and like out of nowhere they pop up or they call you or something? Like you're like, damn, speak of the devil. Yes, you know indeed. what I'm saying? Like that shit happens to me all the fucking time. And then I think I'm crazy in my head. Like, why am I thinking about this person? Why? Why am I thinking about this person? And then you see him, you're like, that's why. <laughs> and then you know they fucking come out of nowhere or they text you or they call you. It's so weird. It's all energy. It's everything it that's is. bouncing back. You know, it's like it's like it's like a fucking satellite. We're all satellites and we're fucking bouncing back and forth. You know what I mean? It's crazy. It's wild if you think about it. <laughs> this guy's fucking this guy's philosophical. We're I love it. A, a yeah. Round of applause. Yeah. We're satellites, wow. guys. Yeah. Remember John said it first. To me? I'm looking at the screen and seeing that, and it's just all making sense. Like, the yeah. universe, finally, <laughs> the stars are aligning for me. Yes. See what I'm saying? Thank Everything you. makes yes. sense. Thank you for that. What would wow. I do without this Just guy? like my forehead. Whoa. Wow. Wow. It's aligning. That thing is a is a piece of art. I don't know. Like, we can sell that as an NFT. <laughs> we can sell that as an NFT and make some guap. Yo, 20 racks. This big. That's you never know. Question, right? yeah. How far? Oh, no. Is it for <laughs> And how far? <laughs> we'll never know. But They'll never know. They'll never, They'll know, never know. If you guys could tell us. Oh, wait, how far do you wash your face? No, how far, how far do, do you, you wash, wash your face? face? Wow. Oh, wow. D- it's dusted right on his fucking... <laughs> I don't know. On his fucking unibrow. Do I, do I stop here or do I stop here? Does my head get oily only here or up here? I'm, you got well, ash let- right on top of that, bitch. Well, I'm going to let you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> I asked right on my noggin, motherfuckers. <laughs> But anyways, <laughs> that's what that's the only thing it's good for. To ash my fucking blood out when he's sucking my no, just kidding, To answer guys. your guys' like mother freaking question, my whole head gets oily, alright? I'm an oily fucking kid. Alright? 
First uh, of all, did you know he's an oily kid? Him? Yeah, he described himself as a kid, ladies. Uh, ladies, you know, did somebody yeah, make John yeah, a man. He's like, actually, actually, you know what a kid is? Is a baby goat. Oh! Wow. wow. Oh, That's bar. fucking bar. crazy. Round of applause, bro. I don't know what to do. That right was guys. mind blowing. Bar. That was yeah, mind blowing. Oh my gosh. He is wow. the goat, guys. That was a boomerang. Guys. That was a. <laughs> show her a fucking boomerang. <laughs> oh, show you I used to watch Boomerang. Remember the cartoons? Yeah, bro. Those were the shit. We talked about it a Filthy thousand animals. times. The, cartoon, you know about the cartoons back then were better, bro. They, oh, yeah. Now they're like he, fucking. You could kill people in them and you wouldn't really think that we're going to. Come on. What? Huh? You what? remember the Looney Tunes? They used to kill oh, each okay. other. I was oh, like, yeah. what, no, what station hey, are you watching? Hey, look, is it smoke? Tom and Jerry. Yeah, that's yeah. true. Come on, bro. When they he, when he they rolled pulled that up, Glocks and shit yeah, out on each other. Bro. Like, they pulled pistols out on each other. And shit, but now you know what kids <laughs> got? Transgenders dancing on Nickelodeon for little kids. Uh, they got a it's show. Just, Bro, it's a sad yeah, world you know, now, bro. Yeah, like, I, woke up, I woke up to this dude going off on, on another guy. They're writing each other fucking paragraphs. I was like, oh. holy shit. Yeah, me and this guy. Oh, some other guy. We weren't, we weren't going off He's on He's a each nice other. guy, though. He's cool. Yeah, no. Nah, yeah, shout, <laughs> nah, shout out to you, bro. Yeah. He, was, he was respectful, bro. Yeah. I, I don't I don't recall his name right now, uh, to be uh, honest. Yeah, it was uh, on Instagram, though. But he it yeah. was a post, um, a story that we had put uh, asking a question. It was somebody else made a post. We yeah. reposted it. And it said, um, like, is it fair that transgenders are getting more of a chance than felons or something yeah. like that or have more opportunities or something? It was something along those lines. And that person felt, you know, they felt a, a certain type of way about it. Like it was but, out of line. Yeah. But it, like we weren't I wasn't disrespectful about it at all, man. And I brought up the. I was like, no, I was like, you got to think about it. Nowadays, transgenders and gays have a lot more opportunities than of convicted felon like you see them on tv you see them and then i brought up to him how i was like you know miss nevada is a trans woman now so they getting opportunities bro you can't yeah. sit here and be like oh no. miss nevada that's gonna run for miss usa is a transgender mm -hmm. woman just right? think about that so so at the end of the day bro it's it's not about i wasn't trying to be disrespectful to any group of people all i was saying is that a convicted felon that did their time, served time, and paid their debt to society should have that same right and that same opportunity as somebody that's transgender. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? I mean, and yeah. I don't see what, what's wrong with that opinion. If that offends somebody, hey man, I'm not in charge of your feelings and your, you know, your your mindset. Hey, everybody's yeah. entitled to their fucking opinion. Yeah, the that's exactly what I and told that's the guy. All it is. That's what I told the guy. You I was like, cool hey man, it? that's cool. Boy. I was like, bro, we can agree to disagree respectfully, yeah. bro. Yeah. And that's that. You know what I'm saying? And like, one, we, we, didn't, yeah, we didn't make the post. It was it was literally a repost. Yeah, it was so, just a repost. Yeah. And he yeah, understood that. He knew that. It yeah. wasn't like yeah. that wasn't his his thing about it. You yeah, know what I'm yeah, saying? But it was yeah. also just a question, right? Yeah. It was, you yeah, you exactly. just trying to find out other people's opinion. Because exactly. that's the whole point of it, right? Some people are gonna say yes, some mm. people are gonna say no. I personally believe they're getting a shit ton of opportunities. They're in kids shows. They're everywhere, bro. You right. can't turn on now a, a movie without seeing somebody because it's all, everybody's included now. You see what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, you could cry about it all day long. I don't give a fuck. If you don't like it, keep moving. Well, they got my ass because when, shit. <laughs> they got my ass because they he got missed, my boy Johnny now. The reason why we got this topic out here is because <laughs> one of our viewers recommended it. He sent me a picture. He said, what do you think about this lady? I said, wow, she bad. And then he put laugh my ass off. Well, that's a trans. I said, well, got my ass. Well, you know, and that's scary. It's <laughs> nah, fucking, it it's scary. You know what I mean? <laughs> hey, shout out to Chris too, bro. He's the one that brought it up to me and he was like, hey. You got to be careful, young, and you got to be careful at the yeah. club. You got to feel the Adam's apple. If it's there, you better get the Look fuck at the out knuckles. Of Look at the knuckles. Look if your knuckles are as big as mine, don't touch me. Let me see. We're going to fight. Let me see. Facts. Facts. <laughs> no, that's sketchy. Guys, listen. You can do whatever the fuck you want. Just, uh, just be yeah, honest. Nah. Just be honest. Right? And listen, bro. And that was the point that I made to that guy. All jokes aside, I was like, look, bro, like, honestly, nobody should be treated any type of way. Like, regardless of your background, lifestyle, mm -hmm. social, economic background, any of that. Yeah. Like, none of that should play a part in how you're respected as a human. But at the same time, bro, we got to stop being soft, man. It, yes. uh, like, you got to stop feeling offended because somebody else has an opposition, like, an opinion that's, like, opposite of but yours. The thing yep. is, is, you know trans? What I'm saying? Is, is this a trans I'm not person? sure. 
I'm not sure. Because why? I didn't even ask. Are that's not so my business. Yeah, and you that's not my saying? business. And that's another thing I told the person. I was like, bro, like that's what, business, what people yeah. do in their bedroom shouldn't it's yeah. not anybody's business or shouldn't be. Because that's why I know everybody, everybody <laughs> nowadays wants to just like yeah, let everybody crazy. know what your sexual preference is and what you do in your bedroom. Yeah. Nobody gives a fuck, and that's nobody's business. Yo, what you do in your bedroom. Either way, if a guy exactly. and a girl are making out at a playground and they're all tongue in each exactly. other, I'm, I'm gonna be like, yo, get a fucking room. Yeah, if two facts. guys are doing it, I'm gonna say, yo, get a fucking room. Yeah. If two girls are doing it, I'm gonna say, get a fucking room. Right. Inappropriate. It's just inappropriate. They're the all fuck? wrong. They're yeah. all wrong in different ways. Exactly. Like, that's really all it comes down to. But yeah. it's like, come on, bro. Like, Shout out to everybody who's doing their thing out there. Yeah, round of applause to people hey, that are living their life. If you, if you want me to call you it, just let me know. I'll call you it. Oh, my if God. Want, here we go. If this you guy. Want, if you want to be called hey, a guys. fucking goat, <laughs> I'll call you Billy the fucking goat, man. Nah, but it's you true, man. I mean? <laughs> Pedro, Pedro made a post that it was similar to that, and it was like, it was sarcastic as fuck, but it was true. It's like mm-hmm. this guy like <laughs> identifies as a leopard, right? So it's I okay. Seen you seen that yeah. shit? I liked it because it's it's true. It's, it's like true. so we should just let this guy fucking go Bite around and like biting people and yeah, biting people and acting like a leopard done because that's what he woke up and identify as. Oh, like, I'm gonna shoot your ass. You know what? I'm gonna go I'm gonna and shoot I'm you like wall. a leopard, bitch. I was scared. I thought it was a leopard on the wall. <laughs> yeah, I got I'm a good gonna... spot right here. <laughs> Right here, bitch. Don't try me. I got a good spot. I'll put your head up there. Yo, everybody identifying as something. The other day, I seen some guy that got surgery. He identifies as Asian now. Oh, some some oh, YouTuber. Fuck off. Right? Oh, my God. We're no, going he got back. his eye surgery, bro. He made his eyes look slanted. We're no. going back. Y'all seen the South That's Park racist. episode? Y'all seen the South Park episode, the Negro Plasty? You remember that? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Y'all wa- y'all that watch South Park know exactly <laughs> what the fuck I'm talking about. No. Nah. It was just an episode where this kid wanted to be a great basketball player. He was like a short <laughs> little Jewish kid. Going Kyle. Already. Kyle. Yeah, yeah. He wanted to be a fucking basketball kid. So he fucking went to the doctor and his parents got him a Negro plasty. And then in that same episode, the funniest shit is that the dad, by the end of the episode, the dad had a dolphin plasty. He became an actual dolphin. Because that's what he wanted to be. Whoa. And I was like, that was back in the fucking day, bro. That was like that early 2000s. That's what I mean. Legend, legend says that he's still swimming in those. <laughs> legend says he's still <laughs> swimming with Free Willy, bitch. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> Free Willy actually died in Norway. What? That was a real whale? Yes. He, the, Wait, went, that was went, based off a true story? Yes, Free Willy. Yes. And they actually, Fuck they released off. him. And he, oh, okay. Well, they he actually died in Olesen, where, where my dad's from, the islands on the coast of Norway. And there's a plaque. For him, mm. and he died there. Yeah, that's fucking amazing. I never knew it was a real what? story. I believe yeah, you. I just never knew it was a real yeah, bro, story. They, then when they that's released crazy. it, they released him and he went back on home. True story. I think he means the actor that played Free Willy. The, the <laughs> no, whale. no, no. It's based on a true story. As I thought you. As nah, there was a whale that was. No, no. It's a, it's based on a true story. Watch for Blackfish. Real. You want to watch a real story about whales, and you can see where that story comes from. Watch the documentary Blackfish about the killer whales. That'll explain everything. And why do you think they released it? And it went back home, and then it died because it couldn't survive. That's sad, man. Yo, yeah. captivity, bro. That's why animals don't belong, and that's like fuck you, Sea World. Yeah, bro. I saw a post that it made sense, bro. It was like next time that you complain about quarantine, think about this, and it was the whales at like Sea World and yeah. how big they are and how little the tanks are. I was like, that's fucked up. You know how many hundred? Like they need hundreds of thousands of miles to roam a day, bro. Now, nah, but those whales move, bro. They be sad. moving, yeah. and they they're, like that's why they swim in a circle. That's why when you go to Sea World or anything, they're fucking they're they're like a uh, fin. It'd be fucking slanted yeah. because all they do is go in a circle. They're not supposed to Their be Their shit slanted. ain't supposed to be slanted. Yeah. Their shit's supposed to be standing straight up. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I got that. Hey, nah, they, they, save, they save a lot of animals, too. So, that you know, it's hard to tell, like... They don't know. save no animals, bro. Mm, yeah, they do. They bro, have, yeah, listen, they do. Man, there's, they a lot, there's a lot of programs. Yeah, there is. I looked into it. There's a lot of programs for, like, <laughs> dolphins, sea turtles, bro, stuff like that. Guys, fuck SeaWorld and SeaWorld. Anybody that still goes to SeaWorld, bro... I don't go to SeaWorld. Exactly. But it's like... Bro, just end that shit, bro. Like they're not; those animals are not supposed to be in a fucking pool in the middle right. of Orlando, Florida. Yeah. They're supposed to be in the middle of the fucking ocean somewhere. Nah, Yo, where Bob nobody Ross can find is them. buried in Orlando. Do you know that? Huh? Do you know Bob Ross is buried in Orlando? Shut up. Thirty minutes from my house. We who gotta go there, man. Bob who, Ross. Who the fuck yes. is Bob Ross? Oh my god. Okay, guys, we're done. Now. This makes no, a lot really of done. sense. <laughs> this right here makes a lot of sense about this guy right here. He, him not. He's too young, ladies. Mm-hmm. He's too he young. He's a kid. <laughs> <laughs> he is. 
I should just stay quiet. You really don't know who it is? No, no, for I, real? I, I, nah, for real. I bet you if I show you a picture of Bob, just show, yeah, just show, just show me a picture, yeah, because I don't, I don't know. I guess now I'll, Bob I'll Ross is a legend. Bob Round of Ross. applause. Round of applause to Bob Ross. Oh, that guy. Okay. The painter. Yeah. Okay. He's okay. buried in Orlando. I didn't know he was dead. We're going to put he a little bush right here. Yeah, he we're died gonna, in Orlando. We're going to put, we're going to paint it. We're going to stroke a little bush right happy here. Happy trees, happy trees. Oh, that bro, was him. Yeah, bro. Uh, like he talked, like I used to watch him and be like, I, I want to be, it. I want to be a painter. Me and he too. gets hoes. Like you could just tell he, the, he was too calm to not get hoes. His hair was yeah. perm too. That oh was yeah. That, that was, that Afro was, he was the legit. only white guy. I need a perm. He was the only white guy with a nigga Afro. Yo, legit. I'm it was nice. You. It was nice. That shit was yeah, smooth. Yeah, he looked ginger too. He was smooth, bro. Oh, he was he, smooth. Hey, yeah. They don't yeah, have my dog. He identified now. Attention to detail. <laughs> <laughs> Attention to details. That's what dog fetish gingers do. Abstract. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But we should go visit his uh, grave. Yeah, no, I would. I would. I'm go. so down. Yeah, I'm serious. I'm down for that, too. Like, he's a legend to yeah, me. Yeah, for real. I really did grow Just up spe- watching him. Speaking of graves, I don't know how about... Uh, I don't know about you guys, but did you guys have a good 4th of July? Because, you know, this it passed. We didn't talk about that. Yeah, no, we didn't. I, I was... I uh, stayed yeah. home, bro. I was yes. with my family. I, my yeah. kids are in town. Shout out to you guys yeah. from New York. I'm not going to lie. I just stayed home and I just made content. I just shot my AR in the fucking 45 and let my daughter <laughs> shoot guns and just let everyone shoot guns. I'm like, here comes America. everyone. You know, you know what my mom did? (laughs) My mom's crazy ass. She went to my grandfather's uh, graveyard site in the military base, not the military base, but the military uh, graveyard takes a firework. Wow. Like a, like a big one. And goes to the oh, my grand, because my, yeah, my grandfather loves fireworks. <laughs> so he went over, she went over to it, fucking lit it and it went up and exploded and she started running. And she was just like, love you, dad. <laughs> she recorded and everything. She's like, love you, dad. <laughs> I bet you my hey, grandma bro. was like, what the listen, fuck? Savage. Crazy ass. Hey, savage. listen. First that of all. That wasn't me. That's my mom. My mom's yeah. a savage. <laughs> we heard you snitch the first, yeah. you the first time. We heard you snitch the first time. You don't have to double back. Hey. Hey. This is evidence now. Hey, y- y- y'all gonna have to find the video. <laughs> this is evidence. Uh, uh, hey, if you nah, can't prove like, it. They're and gonna it. be like, is this your son on tape? Uh, testifying <laughs> that it was you. <laughs> yeah. Yes. No, I'm just kidding. He loves you. He loves you. Still. Oh no, nah, nah, but man. shout out, shout out. That was shout cool. out to your mom, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. crazy. Oh, mad love, mad love. That was funny. <laughs> God damn. But anyways, fuck. But nah, listen, man. Meet the Fockers, bro. I had never seen that movie. This guy. Until this guy showed me a clip, bro. Like Meet the Fockers. They got number two or three already out. I think it's just number two. But me, I, yeah, yeah, the number one is the best. Uh, my favorite part is when he takes out the titty and he fucking just he does the the breastfeeding and shit. You know what that the guy shit does? Was funny, bro. He's like, just just touch it. He's like, no, nah, I'm good. Just like, just, just yeah. grab it right here, but not the nipple. That's for him. Yeah, and he fucking op- he opens up the fridge. The other guy that he's talking to, his his, uh, his son in law, and he fucking just fucking he opens up the fridge like, hmm, what's this? Milk? And drinks it, and he's like, yeah, that's breast milk. That's what I used to fucking insert the the fake titty. He's like. Pfft. Hey, bro. <laughs> That's gross. I mean, people drink breast milk, apparently. They say that it's like it's good for us. Like it has some type of calcium and protein that other milk doesn't have. And I'm like, holy nah, shit. It do- Listen, bro. It's all it's all like scientific, bro. Like when you're a baby and you're born, your mom's milk is the most nutritious thing that you could really give them. Like a mo- as a mother, good. their milk. That's what I'm saying. Because yeah. okay. guess what? Her body produces it's the sweet. milk like what they need specifically. It's like. Yeah. It's, it's fucking mother nature. It's mother nature, bro. Like that milk is specifically made for that specific baby. It's That's not why they else. say you're not supposed to drink cow milk because the cow milk is made for a baby cow. Yeah. Call me weird, but I still like baby food. Baby food tastes good as fuck. Like, baby food. That's like a, a Puerto little, Rican thing, banana, though. We still banana. eat the, yeah. with the fucking little baby face <laughs> on it. You yeah. piece of shit. Yeah. Little Gerber face yeah, ass. That's why I look like a Gerber. <laughs> Yo, that baby said, grew the like fuck. That baby's like fucking 70 years old now. Shout out to her. Shout Damn, out to them. Whatever. They Shout said that the, the Teletub. You remember the Teletub is the son? The little face of the baby? Yeah. That's, she's grown and she's she has a baby. big as fuck, yeah. She has a baby. If they ever make the Teletubbies again, they need to use her baby. Ooh. Yeah. I don't know what's up, man. They need to use my face for something. Maybe the moon. Oh, yo, I know what they could use your face for, like a toilet seat. <laughs> That's yeah, fucked up. Mean, That's fucked up. Out nice. of all the things you said, fucked up. Man. That's some shitty ass behavior. Get it? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I like the bump and grind on my toilet seat. <laughs> yeah. You so. know what? I mean? You know what you can make? You can make like a like a fucking carpet. You know what I'm saying? Oh, there of it your is. Beard? Yes. That's, yeah. that's uh, fucked up. That's fucked what up. What do you mean? How's that fucked up? A carpet of your beard? Yeah. That's dope to have in your room or some yeah. shit. It's like your beard, nigga. 
You know, like a caricature of you. You're confusing him. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't matter. He didn't get the idea. It's Smoke's okay. It's starting okay. to come out of his ears. <laughs> Think it's too hard. He's like, two plus four is seven. I'm trying to connect <laughs> everything together. And I'm like. <laughs> he's trying. Oh, God. He's like, he's almost there. Don't worry about it. Don't That's worry funny, about it. It's all right. But I'll tell you what, guys. I'm hurting. I got yeah. a whisper in here. Oh, shit. What's a whisper? What's a whisper? Let me tell you about a whisper. Yeah. I don't know where that. I, I don't. Know. Is that a that song? Was. I don't know. No, no, he just I, made that up. So round of applause. Round that was. Round. Oh damn, oh that was God. good. <laughs> <laughs> he said round of applause. Ha! Yeah, I'd be fucking up. That's all good. We though, do whatever bro. we want. They whisper. Yeah, facts. If you don't like it? Go fucking. No, but what the fuck is a whisper, Jay? A whisper. Oh, the whisper. The whisper. <laughs> the whisper. Oh, I was like, what the fuck? Hey, I'm like, whisper, no wonder. <laughs> I'm a Yo, fucking spit, though, right? I, I can't pronounce that, everything right. That shit is the same thing as the um, trans Nevada thing, right? At the wee spot. I'm sure most of you know about the wee spot in California. You know, the there was a full-blown dude with his pee-pee out, all fucking erected and shit, walking around the women's locker room with girls, little girls and women, you know, it's a women's locker room, but he told the front counter staff he identifies as a woman. Right? If you're transgender, you shouldn't still have a penis and walking around. And she said it was a full blown man. She's like, I'm a grown woman. She's yeah, like, I nah. know what a man's look, it was a penis. <laughs> there was balls. That's what she nah, said. Fuck all that. Hey, I'm fucking that guy up, whoever it yeah. is. Oh, I thought you said if that if my daughter was in there, bro, that'd be yeah, a problem. Yeah, I'd be waiting for him outside. Yeah. I'd be like, I'm gonna go in there. Right? And when they're like, sir, you can't go in there. I'll be like, no, no, no. I'm just, I identify as a female right now. Just for like, give me 10 minutes to yeah, identify facts. as a female. And then I'll be right out. I'll be out. Facts. The culture the culture is so different, though, if you think about it. It's so fucking weird. I don't want to see dicks, guys. I yeah. don't. I don't. But look, but yeah, listen, it's just, listen. It's, it's just, I never saw anything like that when I went to Europe, but I seen it here in America. That's crazy, right? Like, I've been in, like, the locker rooms over there in Europe. Like, I went to a water park, right? In Norway, it's an inside <laughs> one. <laughs> And everybody's mm-hmm. talking to each other, having conversations while they're naked. <laughs> while they're naked. I've never seen any. I didn't see nothing weird, anything like that. But it was just like, this it's normal to be in. naked. <laughs> normal to be naked and just walking around. And I'm just like, me and my brother are like sitting here like, nah, I ain't taking no, off my boxes. That's bitch. normal in Europe. Like, you yeah. know what I'm saying? It's more like they grew up like that. But the, in America, we didn't, right? Yeah, exactly. So at the end of the day, it's like, right? For example, if a trans dude, right, came into the dude's bathroom. I'm not gonna look at him and be like, oh man, I'm gonna fuck this guy. You see what I'm saying? I don't I don't think that. Just let nigga use the bathroom and get the fuck yeah, out. Yeah. The fuck like out. I don't get you don't need to use the female bathroom because I'm sure the normal straight dudes and the dudes we're not gonna hit on you. We're probably gonna turn around and not look at you. Yeah, at we don't give a fuck. Yeah, so facts. why does it matter they like nah? A woman should be able to just be feel safe, right? In the woman's locker room. Because you have a wife and daughter, you want them to feel safe. Yeah. Man, what if that dude was in there and just starts, oh, then you hear, oh, a woman was raped at the wee spa in the bathroom because some dude. Then you hear yeah. shit like that. Oh, what could we have done to prevent this? I'm, Ultimately, I yeah. bro, they need to treat that shit like you're going in a county jail. Yeah. You have a pussy, you go over here. You have a dick, you go over here. It doesn't matter if you have fake tits on your chest or not. Yeah. Get the fuck over there. Yeah, we got women. Period. Yeah, women. Period. Yeah. If you don't have that surgery... If you haven't had that surgery, because guess what? The transgender women that actually had the surgery, you go to the woman's prison. Oh, but what if happened? you have a fucking... Bro, come on, bro. What if you happened? have a dick, bro, you're not going yeah. to women's prison. And it doesn't matter what you feel like. What happens like... Okay, so that's kind of stupid, though, because the way I look at it is like, all right, you don't know this person. What if this person has breast cancer and they had to cut off their tits? What? If, okay, that's cool. I get it. But you can't just fucking sit here and judge. Like Everybody's going to be different. If you're a woman, you're a woman. Exactly. You know what I mean? That's it's why like, they have medication and shit now. And then the commercials are like, if you were born a woman, then you need to let us know or let your doctor know. Okay, that means that you have different insides, different things. Why is it becoming a problem with the transgender? Oh, you got to let people know. Because if you get in a car accident and you need something done to you, your insides and your whole fucking... It's different. It's different than a woman. Your structure is yeah. different, bro. Your structure is different. things they might have to do 
and that if you're a man or a woman or you see you got they gotta know so this yeah. is gonna cause some we gotta, problems we gotta wrap it up that's a fact and that's well, listen it. guys we appreciate hey, everybody that's hey. rocking like and sharing subscribing don't forget hit that notification bell so you're notified every time we drop man go down in the description get yourself some merch if you haven't done so already and listen man only about half of y'all are fucking subscribed so what are we doing what are we doing yeah yeah hit that button man you, you, hit better, that button. Hit, you better hit that thumbs up button that's a fact there you go but listen peace of love baby